SIU men's basketball is off to a fast 4-0 start. They're becoming the talk of the town. Tough part is fans can't see them play. That's where we come in. Saluki's finishing up a two-game matchup with North Dakota. So let's show you some extended highlights. Here we go. A matinee affair from an empty Banterra Center. Feels weird. Down 3-2. Took SIU nearly three minutes to hit their first field goal. Trent Brown from three. Salukis will trail no more. On Thursday, they shot 62% from long distance. Lance Jones makes it back-to-back -back threes. And after Thursday's win, Brian Mullins praised the defensive effort, wanted to see it lead to the transition game, and the boys got the memo. Ben Harvey just misses a double-double, finishes with 12 points, 9 rebounds. And Marcus Damask scored just 8 points on Thursday on 3 of 9 shooting. More efficient on Friday, 7 of 12 from the floor. And Damask, oh, he can pass too. Great feed to Kyler Filowich. And the freshman made the most of his 16 minutes, scoring nine off the bench. And then this trip down the floor, uh-uh, Damask isn't passing. Watch where he launches it from. Wow, are you kidding me? The logo. Yeah, he's got range. Team high, 17 points. SIU shot 27% from three. Wouldn't know it from Marcus's three. And then that one there from Harvey. Saluki's only led by four at the half. Anthony Devanzo got going, fights off two defenders. 11 points, eight rebounds for the grad transfer from Lewis. And in back-to-back -back games, you worry about fatigue, but SIU remains stifling on defense, and the dogs are off and running. Lance Jones, seven assists, and here he finds Ben Harvey. Oh, make that twine dance. And Ben's mom and dad, yeah, they like it too. Saluki Nation, they like being 5-0. and SIU gets the sweep. They hold off North Dakota, 62-50. Come back you know, the next day and play the same team and, and kind of have that same intensity, same focus as the, as the first game, I think it's going to be really valuable for us when we play Evansville. So it's not easy to beat anyone twice, especially not back-to-back. -back. Um, and our defensive effort and, and the way the guys played connected today on that end helped us win the game. I was getting a lot of similar looks. Uh, we watched film and coaches kind of talked to me about the looks that they thought I could get off that I wasn't taking last game. and. I mean, it's just a matter of my teammates having confidence in me. They're all telling me, just keep shooting, they're going to drop. So, I mean, I just went out with a clear mind and just played like we didn't play yesterday.